What's up guys? So need to empty out a few more tanks. Uh, mostly because let me zoom out. Um, I want to buy some new breeders, a new breeding fish, some more rare stuff. So uh, these guys still 50% discount. Um, normally the Melvin is there 35, cut that in half, 17-ish. Um, but yeah, 15, I'll, I'll try and remember to write prices and a big 50% off sign. Um, Tanganyikans, no discount because those are really cheap and good deals. Um, better than most online places. I do have the Grizzlies. Um, I am going to do uh, like a buy three, get one free kind of deal for the Grizzlies, these guys. Because I have about 100 50 ish of them so those have that promotion um, same thing these Africans 50% off I don't want them goldfish they're fine I'll do like 5% off I'll do a bigger discount if you buy at least 3 I'll do 15% off um, total price um, and then the black marbles, those are buy three, get one free. And it's five bucks for the smaller ones, ten bucks for the larger ones. If you buy ten of the big ones, you get one big one free. Um, let's go swap out that pump. Doing a water change on the oh whoops I have to disconnect this other one um that's that one doing a water change on the 300 gallon let me move this hose back inside but yeah I, I ju I'm just trying to gain some money back uh to order some more fish some more future breeders so buy three going free on the angels the nicaragüenses i'll do the same thing uh buy three get two free um i have a bunch of these guys um these are fine these are fine then i did get a bunch of new fish so i have five pairs of uh, the gold red shoulder MacMasterize or golden red shoulder MacMasterize. I'll show you the other thing. I barely threw them in here yesterday, so they're still a little stressed. Then I have more Celestial Pro Daniels. I have 15 of those left. I have more um, orange Venezuelan Cories, and I have a few gold laser quarries you can see them back there i have six of the gold lasers these are more of the venezuelan they're good size and then i have i believe i only have one more male uh nanakara uh, this should be the male and then three or two more females this one kind of looks like another male too but I'll give it some time and we'll see if it's male or female. But I have those, those are 15 each. Uh, the orange Venezuelan, those are 15. The lasers, um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep them or sell them, but if I was to sell them around 25, 30 bucks each, um, or if you wanna take all of them, I'll give you a good deal. Um, let's see. Other than that, don't ask about that Amazon sword. I'm keeping it. It's going for uh, into a big tank. Talked about those. Venustis, 15% off. These guys, the big ones. Uh, best offer takes them. 20 bucks. You have to come pick them up. If you offer me over text, I don't care. Uh, but come in person, give me an offer, take them. 
I want to empty out this whole tank also. These are bigger Nicaraguenses. Um, yeah, these are, they should be sexable size. Um, they were colored up, but I threw them in here because I took their tank. They were up there. Um, but those, probably like 15 each. And then I have a Ripsaw Catfish. Uh, I'd do a hundred bucks for him. These ones, no rush. I could keep them. Uh, let's see what else. Um, see, I have more Nicaraguenses in here. And then I have all the fish in this pond. So, in here, I do five bucks each fish. I'll probably give you a nice, a few extras if you buy fish from here. So I have some regular Comet Goldfish, that guy. And then I have that Black Belt. The Black Belt, I need at least 50 bucks from him. He's around eight inches long. And then I have a bunch of Umbunas. Some Obi Umbunas, there's Red Zebras. Um, I can't remember the name of those blue ones with the stripes. They're vertical stripes, not horizontal. Uh, I have two big plecos in here. Uh, you can kind of see that guy right there. Um, why can't I remember the name of this catfish? But I have that guy. Then I have a big tilapia. You know what, I'll do two dollars each fish in here, each small one. Tilapia, those are illegal, but if someone wants to eat it, free, come get it. You can see how thick it is. You'll get some nice food out of it. There's a red rainbow shark in there. Black belt, 50 bucks. Oh, I have the medallas. That one at least 15. He's around six inches. Um, but every other cichlid, goldfish, um, Siamese, algae eater, suckerfish, any other fish, two dollars. I want this thing empty too. Because I'm getting some other monster fish and I like to put them in here. And then I have a couple more goldfish in here and, and I think it's like some type of shubrokin, shubrokin. That guy, it's pretty cool. Five bucks for him. The other, the other two, two dollars. I have some baby Venustis, mix dragon blood with a uh, blue peacock. Couple bucks for those if you want them. Um, let's see, ruby reds. Another male colored up. I'd sell the whole group for about 30 bucks. Uh, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11 fish for what, 30 bucks? You could grow out that male and sell it at least for 20, 30 bucks. Um, oh, and then I do have one more breeding pair of Kagunga Firefin. Not this guy, this is my main breeder, but it's his brother. Uh, his brother's over here, he's a little camera shy. But he got in a fight with the uh, Tanganyikan eel. But his, his dorsal should heal up, it should grow back, maybe. No, it's not gonna grow back, because it did, it did go down into his body. But uh, he has given me babies before. Um, so I'd sell him. His female is in the 130. Selling those two, I sell the I'd sell that one because his fin's injured for 200. But it's a proven pair, uh, 200 bucks. And then I have some baby green terrors, about inch and a half. Um, I'd want let's see. They're pretty colorful. 
the parent was a white seal or white tip and then the orange tip um, 10 bucks if you buy more than five I'll do seven dollars each if you buy more than five uh, goldfish he was in quarantine need to throw him out with the other ones two for Hakka puffers they're ready to go they've been killing all the snails that are in their tanks uh, $50 each pretty cool guys um, this guy was hiding down in his bed I probably need to throw more snails in there he's probably hungry let's see any um, here's a couple come here oh it fell Eh, he didn't see it. Oh, damn it. Okay, there's this one. He might not attack it because I'm in its face. But yeah, they, there's a bunch of empty shells. Um, let's see. Oh, here's the uh, gold red shoulder MacMaster eye. These are the same ones that uh, Dan's fish sells for a hundred dollars for a trio. That's crazy expensive. I'd never sell a trio that much. Um, these are thirty bucks for the males, and the females are fifteen. And have pretty much exactly five pairs, four or uh, four pairs, because I am keeping two for myself for uh, next door for the breeding area. Then there's a few more hiding in the the plant. And then let's see what else. I do have a bunch of Omeka Splendid. 10 bucks for those. I have males and females, and then these younger juveniles. I'd sell them probably like six dollars. They're about an inch right now. I usually don't like selling small fish, but if someone wants them, I'll sell these juveniles for what did I say, six dollars each. And then we have a bunch of zebra tiger lima, limias. So those, I'll probably drop the price down to like $6 each. I was selling them for 10, but we have a bunch more coming. So I'd sell those for six bucks. Tight, uh, guppies, I don't have that many, that many cool ones. Right now I turned off the light because I used the plug that it was connected to. Um, plecos, I do have a bunch of browns, regular browns, but those are a good price, five bucks. Five bucks, that's inch and a half, two inches. That one's two inches. All of them are five bucks. Then I do have some long fins, browns, chocolates. Sell those for 15. Then I still have a bunch of green dragons. Good size inch and a half to three inches those are 20 or I have bigger males for 30 bucks um, if anybody wants this one I found a bigger tank that I want this is 150 acrylic uh, 48 wide 24 48 long 24 wide and I think 35 tall it's used, give me uh, 600 bucks for it. <laughs> yeah, I found a bigger tank that I want. Um, Tanganyikins, like I said, no discount on those. Um, but if someone wants some of the Signatas, I'll do a discount on those. But you have to buy more than five and then I'll give you a discount. Because I have those adults and then I have this batch of younger juveniles and then I have another batch coming up of smaller babies 
I'll do a discount on those. Here I have more grizzlies. Um, so I need to sell those. Those are the buy three, get one free. Um, oh yeah. <clears throat> I have one more disc is left. And the pigeon bloods, five inches. This one is a bit more orange, a uh, hundred bucks. And then I am selling the Geo Red Top Top of Joe's, the Geo Vegas. I have six of them. Let me zoom in. So there's three smaller, two and a half, three inch ones. That one, one in the middle, and then that guy. And I have three bigger ones. They're four, five inch. That guy right there. That's the main male. And there's this middle one. That one's about four inches, and then there's this guy. This one's about four inches, four and a half. That guy, he's for sure five inches, maybe five and a half. I want to sell those. Um, take all of them for 300. And the big ones, they should be breeding size. Starting, They should start to pair up. And then the smaller ones, they still have quite a bit to grow. But they have some nice color on them as well. Um, if someone wants some of the, these bigger discs, I'll sell them, but around $80, 80 to $100. I'm keeping these, mo these red ones, but I'd sell these blue ones. And I'm pretty sure these two have paired up. I haven't seen no breeding, but there's two that are always together. Um, and I still have two phantom red tails. Uh, one is six inches and the other one is still a, around four and a half. But he's going to start growing quickly in this tank. Uh, the, the six inch. Um, those I want, that one I want 200. The smaller one, 150. Then the angels, mana capera. Those are still for sale, 20 bucks each. And then I'd sell these two discus. These were ones I like the body and I like the color. I'd sell them for 150 each. Um, and then I still have some of these smaller discus. These are 30. Uh, let's see what else. The plants. If you're interested, I can ship these out as well. I have boxes that are big enough for them. I will insulate the box as well. Um, but yeah, some of these are a little pricey. There's a few more common plants. Lots of pothos, bamboo, um, tight constellation. A few more back there. If you want this big one too, I could sell it as well. I think this one was 350 mostly because of the pot the pot is a fancy pot uh, but i have all of these as well take a screenshot and message me circle the plan that you like i like this one i like how yellow it is uh, these are 15 these are 10 dollars and these are 15 some of these are a little bit more money. But yeah, they're all for sale. I am making the custom lids. If you, if anyone's interested in them, we can make them for you. And they hold the standard little pot in it. I'll come fix that. I'll fix that later. Um, in here, Nothing for sale in there, unless you want to overpay my no for sale price. Um, let's see, I think that's it. But yeah, I'm make I'm doing a lot of deals on fish that are for sale that I want that I want to sell. I was planning on keeping some, but I'd sell them. There's a few rare. Tanganyikans that I want to bring in to start breeding um, some other types of ocelata 
but I've never seen them locally to me and I haven't seen them uh, much in the hobby for sale on websites uh, there's a couple other shell dwellers that I want to bring in oh yeah I have three breeding pairs of brevis um, these are ah, what's the location sunspot I think because they have a nice yellow on their forehead can't remember what their what location but I have three breeding pairs this is one pair then I have two others in some of the five gallons that should have babies hopefully um, what else what else I have a few monster fish if anybody is, really wants them let me turn off the bubbles Gunch catfish don't want to sell them but someone's interested message me uh, Siberian sturgeon sell them too and then I have the paraiba these are some of my dream monster fish and look how big his whiskers are his whiskers are longer than his body both of them I have those three and then in here I have a little guy, a little tigrinus, tigris, not tigrinus. He's five inches, growing slow, but he's there. Um, if someone wants him, let me know, but he wouldn't be less than 300. The others, same thing, I wouldn't sell them anything under 300 because they're pretty bad especially this guy and once I sell some of these fish I do plan on getting some uh, diamond sturgeon the white diamonds so that's why I want to sell some of these higher end fish so 300 200 dollar fish so I could get some money and bring in some sturgeon and bring in some of the more rare um, Tanganyikans I do need to bring in some discus and the sturgeon I need to bring in uh, let's see what else oh some more epistogramma that's the other one we will be doing an order for Pistogramma in about two weeks. Um, and we'll be keeping half of them for breeding and the other half will be for sale. But there's probably only going to be one or two pairs for sale. Uh, some more triple red cuckatoides, uh, orange flash, um, regular MacMaster eye, uh, some Borlei, not Borlei. Are they Borlei? I think it's Borlei, um, Epistogramma, and Transfasciatus, Trans, Trans, can't remember the name, um, but yeah, I'm, we're bringing like five Epistos, and only going to sell about one pair or two pairs out of each, the rest we're going to keep, and then later in the week I'll show you what next door looks like, we'll be breeding all the angelfish in there well some of the angelfish in there uh, we're gonna breed the discus next door and the epistogramma next door uh, a couple other uh, dwarf cichlids those nanakara we're gonna breed in there the crypto hero um, can't remember the name the yellow ones I need to separate those so we can start breeding those and a few others we're gonna breed next door um, but yeah let me know send me a message Facebook um, or you can look up on the website I can't remember if I, if I have the number posted on the website um, but you could call or text me it's my personal phone number it's what I've always done business with But yeah, trying to 
give some good deals. I've been selling a lot of my pairs of compressor steps. I've sold three so far. I can't sell this guy. He's not colored up. He's not in his breeding colors. But this is a Chaitika yellow. This is, ah, the brother's not even colored up either. But the brother was my profile picture for a bit. Because he was nice and yellow. Um, but yeah, those are the, this is the last one, Chaitika. That's for sale, look like the female. Female looks good. They might start breeding soon actually. But they're for sale. That one I do 200. And then the Kagunga Fire Fin male. I do 200 because of his dorsal fin. But besides that, they don't bother, it doesn't bother them at all. And this is his brother. Oh no, he's still in the cave. And the female just ran in there too. But I have other videos of him. Just look at the other thing in Ekans. These are ones I'm gonna grow out to breed. Uh, camera doesn't want to zoom in. So I have those and then these. I uh, can't even remember the name of these. But those that know, you'll know by the body shape what species it is. But yeah, I plan on breeding these, growing them out. And then a few other... Um, top swimming cichlids and uh, a few shell dwellers are the ones I want to bring in oh and a couple compercepts I'm working on a deal on a breeding group of some compercepts that uh, I'll be getting for my own yeah that's it videos long enough see you guys later